Hello, lovies. I just got done with my week 27 appointment at my orthodontist and he put in two awesome little jewels in my mouth. Looks like I have a piercing or something. It's so awkward and weird, but I got two little brackets here. I don't know if you can see clearly that they are two brackets with a rubber band because as I was going in for my check-in, check-up, whatever, make sure my teeth are moving as they should. Apparently these two right here are not catching up to the liner. So these are going to pull it up is what he said. So, and they also, I was also missing an attachment back here. I don't know how, because I don't really eat hard foods or whatever. So I'm not sure, but that was that consisted of my week 27 appointment he also did his mighty grinding and teeth filing today gotta love that you know your teeth are already so sensitive and being moved all over the place right and ugh, it hurts my soul i don't know why you know some some people are like yeah this doesn't hurt this whole process is your teeth are wobbly you must not have any feeling in your teeth or something or in your mouth a period like you would be the perfect torture victim because you don't care about your freaking teeth getting hurt or whatever or you just don't feel it so if they if they pull all your teeth out torturing you you won't feel a damn thing so i don't know what i'm saying but seriously this, this whole process hurts i don't like it and i can't wait to be finished i am only nine weeks away to be finished but i don't know if i really am finished because i've seen some people's teeth relapse and all that stuff and i want to make sure i mean i i hope that i don't have an underlying issue that i don't know of like tongue thrust or something like that like i don't think i have tongue thrust but what does that even mean thrust your tongue every like hard against your teeth like i don't like I, I don't do that i already am like weary of where my tongue goes and make sure that it's not like surpassing my teeth or whatever or sucking on my thumb you know because that's what that's why my teeth were like this in the first place was i was you know a thumb sucker so what to do what to do anyways what do you guys think about my new teeth piercing i'm gonna show you my progress Week 27. That is all I have to update with you guys today. Or maybe not. I, I think I have another thing. I forgot what I was going to say. Oh, they, they, they gave me a bunch of rubber bands. And I kind of found the little niche, little way to take it on and off. Because I had to take the rubber band every time I eat. Uh, I mean, I had to take the whole rigmarole off anyway. So I take off the rubber band and the Invisalign off before I eat. She taught me how to do it. I had to do it a couple times to make sure I got, you know, the hang of it. We we did a, we went through it a few times and made sure I got it. And, and it should be all right. You know, it's not that bad to put it on. And you really can't see it unless I actually show all my teeth or whenever I'm talking, whatever, you know. But you really can't notice it, which I'm not that annoyed by. But just letting you guys know, this could be a possibility. If your teeth are not cr correctly grasping onto the Invisalign, this can happen to you too. So make sure, I think it was because I wasn't using the gummies, the chewies, I'm sorry, the chewy. You know, every time, because my teeth were so sore, you know? They were already so sore and you have to bite down on this chewy. So I recommend using the chewies, making sure that your aligners, every time that you put them back on, use the chewy. Use it, make sure that it's grasping. Cause I think that this is the result of that. So, alrighty guys, thank you for watching. See you on my next video.